Did you know, the asteroid responsible for the extinction of dinosaurs was approximately the size of Mount Everest? As if things didn't seem apocalyptic enough already on Earth, scientists have reported that a comet three times bigger than Mount Everest exploded and is hurtling toward our planet at a staggering speed exceeding 40,000 miles per hour or 20 kilometers per second. While for us humans, catching a glimpse of a comet or a shooting star is a rare stroke of luck, when we spot one, the instinctive response is to make a wish as we witness its fleeting journey across the sky. But if you know how the age of dinosaurs came to an end, it sheds light on the gravity of these luminous streaks in the sky. Despite their relatively smaller size compared to other celestial entities, asteroids and comets wield the potential to unleash catastrophic devastation upon entire planets. Today, we are embarking on a celestial journey to explore a comet called 12P Ponsbrooks, more commonly recognized by the ominous name, the Devil Comet, because it looks like it has horns. It is currently making its way towards Earth and is anticipated to undergo a significant eruption soon. Scientists say this enormous comet might even be visible without a telescope in 2024 as it gets closer to Earth. So, what's the story behind the Devil Comet? Let's find out! The Devil Comet or Comet 12P Ponsbrooks falls under the category of short-period comets. Just to clarify, any comet with an orbital period of less than approximately 200 years is classified as a short-period comet. In the case of the Devil Comet, it completes one orbit around the Sun every 71 years. If this time frame sounds familiar, it's noteworthy to mention that one of our celestial luminaries, the renowned Halley's Comet, is also a short-period comet, making its appearance from Earth every 75 to 79 years. Moreover, not only do they share nearly identical sizes, but, much like Halley's Comet, the Devil Comet is no stranger to gracing our skies. Indeed, Ponsbrooks is not a newcomer and has been making its presence known on Earth since the year 1812, thanks to the keen observation skills of the comet hunter, John Lewis Pons. Unfortunately, the observations made during that time were not precise enough to predict the comet's return. Consequently, it was rediscovered in 1883 by William Brooks. Since then, a multitude of astronomers diligently investigated the whereabouts of this celestial visitor. Their collective research led to the intriguing conclusion that Ponsbrooks might have been making visits to our planet as far back as the year 1385. Based on its luminosity, astronomers say the comet measures a colossal 18.6 miles in diameter, or the size of a small city. For reference, Mount Everest, the highest mountain on Earth is 29,000 feet high, or about 5.5 miles. This comet is also called a cryovolcanic comet, meaning it's a cold volcano. A cryovolcano is a kind of volcano that spews out stuff like water, ammonia, or methane into extremely cold environments, even colder than freezing temperatures. This comet is said to be one of 20 comets that are known to have ice volcanoes that are still active. So, why is Ponsbrooks called the Devil Comet? Before we get to that, it's important to learn about this comet's behavior. A noteworthy event is that this comet experienced a remarkable outburst in late July 2023. During this outburst, it expelled a significant amount of gas and dust, intensifying its brightness by more than 100 times. Ponsbrooks underwent an unforeseen surge in its magnitude. In astronomy, Magnitude serves as a measure of the brightness of a star or any other celestial object. The lower or more negative the magnitude of an object, the brighter it appears in the sky. Now, here comes the intriguing twist. Following the outburst, Ponsbrooks underwent a staggering transformation overnight, shifting from magnitude 17 to magnitude 12. That's a substantial change. Although this comet has displayed a penchant for such performances multiple times in each orbit, these outbursts are completely random, entirely unpredictable, and quite uncommon. So why was the comet showing such an excited behavior? When a comet approaches the sun, it heats up and forms an atmosphere. This hazy cloud enveloping the nucleus of a comet is termed a coma. 
Following the July outburst, the coma underwent a distortion, taking on a horn configuration with a dark center and menacing wings, creating the eerie semblance of a demon with horns. Media outlets swiftly seized on this devilish appearance, leading to the naming of Ponds Brooks as the Devil Comet. It's intriguing to note that some enthusiasts draw connections between the comet's devilish appearance and the Millennium Falcon Comet, a celestial object better known as the legendary starship from the Star Wars universe. Despite the devilish semblance settling down after the initial outburst, with the comet's brightness stabilizing, Pons Brooks had more surprises in store. It unleashed another outburst in early October 2023, bringing back those eerie horns. This celestial phenomenon has genuinely perplexed astronomers. Researchers remain uncertain about the precise cause behind the formation of these mysterious horns. One proposed hypothesis suggests that the formation of the eerie horns might result from the comet expelling its gaseous and dusty contents in an uneven manner into space. However, an intriguing aspect is the dark surface at the center of the comet. Astronomers posit another hypothesis, proposing that there could be a specific region on this central surface that remains mysteriously calm, refraining from emitting any gas. Consequently, this calm region could contribute to a darker appearance compared to the two brighter regions on either side. An alternate hypothesis posits that the center of the comet may feature a denser and more even topography, obstructing a portion of the bright light originating from behind. This obstruction could create the illusion of a dark shadow at the center of the comet. Certainly, astronomers continue their investigations to unravel the mysteries surrounding the unique structure of this comet. What remains certain is that the distinctive features of Pondsbrooks contribute to one of the most captivating enigmas within the scientific realm. Now let's jump to the most burning question. Is the Devil Comet going to hit Earth, and do we need to panic? Don't worry about a big collision with Comet Ponds Brooks just yet. Scientists say it won't get really close to Earth until 2024, when we can see it without a telescope. After that, it will return to space and won't come close to us again until 2095. So Comet 12P Ponds Brooks does not pose any danger to Earth as of now. How do we know this? Well, it's important to recognize that space operates in three dimensions. While planets in our solar system typically orbit the Sun in a relatively flat plane, comets aren't bound by the same constraint. Pondsbrooks follows a highly inclined orbit, descending from above the plane of the planets. It is true that the comet comes close, even penetrating the orbit of Earth, but the proximity is insufficient for a collision. Although the comet will traverse the inner solar system and pass between the orbits of Earth and Venus, its trajectory will never intersect with Earth's orbit. This peculiar comet has sparked immense excitement among sky watchers. For enthusiasts of sky gazing, it's worth noting that the Devil Comet is en route, and catching a glimpse of it promises to be a delightful experience. Adding an extra layer of fascination, the astronomical spectacle of spotting the Devil Comet aligns perfectly with the total solar eclipse scheduled for April 8, 2024. Indeed, the comet will be visible during this total solar eclipse. The comet is currently part of the Hercules constellation. It can be observed when one faces the east to northeast direction with a 36 degree altitude over the horizon. As it nears the Earth, the rock may keep on erupting even more violently than it did in the past. According to astronomers, the Devil Comet is anticipated to be observable in the vicinity of April 2024. Consequently, as the eclipse traverses North America, rest assured that Comet Pondsbrooks will already grace the sky, positioned closely to the Sun. If we get lucky, we might even witness another sudden outburst in the celestial expanse. Picture this captivating scene, the moon obscuring the sun while a shooting star embellishes the sky. The Devil Comet is set to make its closest approach in June 2024, potentially visible to the unaided eye. Undoubtedly, this presents an exceptionally extraordinary celestial spectacle atop an already thrilling cosmic event. Be sure not to let this momentous occasion pass you by. We are interested to hear your thoughts about the Devil Comet, 
Leave a reply in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.